Hey there, I'm Jess, CertiCraft's learning facilitator. Today, I'm going to show you how easy it is to breeze through CRA inspections and audits with CertiCraft. With one click, you'll have the paperwork you need for the CRA in a format auditors love. Let's take a look. Open CertiCraft and click the Reports tab at the top of the page. Click on Audits and then select the CRA option. Select one of the months that the CRA is asking about. I'll choose May 2024. Click Download. You'll now get a pair of spreadsheets saved to your computer. One is for packaged inventory and one is for unpackaged inventory. I'm going to show you the unpackaged inventory report. What we're looking at is CertiCraft's government data model. This spreadsheet lists every data entry made in CertiCraft in the month of May that affected your government reports. For each entry, this report shows what field in the B300 was updated and how it was changed. In this one download, CRA inspectors have all the information they need for their audits for a single month. This report uses CertiCraft categories that are more detailed than the government categories. Our columns represent your inventory types. You can see those in the top row. Some products, like seeds, are further broken down into multiple unit types. Our rows represent different inventory change categories. You can see some of those categories in the leftmost column. At the intersection of the rows and columns, we have our data entries. Each intersection maps to a different category within the B300. For example, the intersection of vegetative cannabis plant and from producers is called vegetative cannabis plant quantity received in Canada in the B300. After defining how a particular intersection maps to the government reports, we have our data entries. As you can see here, we added plants to our facility from suppliers twice. 500 plants on May 4th, and 1,200 plants on May 7th. If the CRA wants me to prove I added 1,700 plants this May, this shows them all the relevant details, with enough info to easily find the original records if that was important. Making sense so far? Down here, we'll find a new intersection that maps differently to the B300. It says that I took 420 cuttings from our mothers, and because I only did that once in May, you only see one record. If a section is empty, like seeds, here, that means we didn't do anything that changed that category during the month. Let's scroll all the way to the right and see how this all translates to processing. With extracts, Health Canada tracks by weight and the CRA tracks by milligrams of THC. CertiCraft automatically calculates all of this for you. And here we break it down into relevant individual entries. Data entries that affect multiple categories show up multiple times in this report, like these received hash container records. This report gives auditors everything they need with one download, saving you a lot of stress and seriously reducing the time an audit takes. Thanks for watching.